face the wall. We're not going to look at the sun yet. You're just going to go out, face the wall, and then we'll all turn and look at it at the same time. Okay? See anything? Do not turn around until you're done. Oh, are we ready? Put on your glasses and you're going to turn around and you're going to look up. You learn like the sun, like it, when you look at it without the glasses on, it looks like it's like light is scattered everywhere so it looks like it has lines on it. Yeah, everywhere. but then when you put the glasses on it looks like this like which yellowish ball mm -hmm. that you would never thought it would look like. No. And you can only see that. Like there's nothing yeah. else. And then there's nothing else you can see. And technically we can see it like without the scattering light because it's technically I think he said it was blocking the atmosphere and we can see that. Yeah, and so you could see the uh, sun, and it had no like scattering light around it. Yeah. Um, I liked it. It was fun, mm -hmm. and it makes me want to be like a scientist and learn more about it. Makes me want to be an astronaut now. Yeah. <laughs> Is it change? Uh, did you all want to do something else when you grow up before yeah. this? Yeah. But now I want to do this. It's really cool. I might actually do both if I have to. <laughs> what what both of what astronaut and what else? Baseball player. <laughs> like weekends I'm off of baseball, I go there and the other go back to there. Okay. <laughs> Today we had Dr. Morales and he came to us from uh, Kennedy Space Center and NASA. He's an educational specialist. The reason we invited him is at our school we've been studying the four forces of flight as part of our STEM curriculum and we started with the Wright brothers and we looked at you know where flight began and so we've taken it pretty much through history and we want to show our students the opportunities they have in the future and the opportunities that they're going to have because they're learning the math, the science, the technology, the skills they're learning today in elementary school are going to be the ones that are going to help us go to Mars and help us to explore our universe and so we invited Dr. Morales to come and share with the student the vision of NASA and share with them the excitement of space exploration and to share with them that the team building activities we do in STEM, the math they're learning in third grade, that's what's going to help us get to space and that's what's going to help us explore our universe. We don't know if any of our students sitting here are astronauts, engineers, they might be a wildlife management specialist who's going to one day work at NASA. And so we're trying to light some fire, some educational fire, um, and give them some motivation to learn their times tables, <laughs> to learn you know, the forces, not just to fly, but the forces in the universe, and to make a connection between what we do here at Duncan Creek with the universe, but also their future. And I'm the specialist, the education specialist for Kennedy Space Center. I cover the state of Florida, Georgia, Puerto Rico, and the Virgin Islands. And my job is actually to disseminate what NASA is doing as far as education, about resources for teachers, try to um, entice teachers to use our curricula so that they can actually entice their students to go into a STEM field, engineering, math, science. Uh, and so it's not supposed to substitute what they're doing, but it's supposed to entice the student into uh, finding out uh, more about what NASA's doing, the missions, you know, what the objectives are, the mission of NASA, the vision of NASA. So uh, my job is that, to, to basically make sure that whenever I'm in a location, that I do as much as I can to make sure that the students understand that there's a place for them with us, that they are the next generation of explorers, and therefore come and, exp come and explore with us because uh, we, need your, we need your skills, your abilities, your enthusiasm to take us to the next level.